So, I have a 58 millimeter lens, which I'm trying to make a filter for, for the solar eclipse. After looking through all of this plumbing stuff, I came down to... Okay, so what I came down and found was uh, this little honey right here. Square black drain, great adapter, three inch, four inch, and I'll show you why I'm choosing this. So this fits in here pretty good and has a little bit of slack all the way around. And I'm gonna fill that with some padding and stuff so I can modify this and slide it on and off really easily. You'll see, check it out. Okay, so the drain piece that I showed you over there at uh, Home Depot, what I did is I cut down the edges on it and uh, took it to a bench grinder and just ground it off real nice and even and uh, actually padded the inside of it. You can see the padding there. Um, and right now it's, just, it's the exact size to slide, to slide on and off of my camera lens really nice and easy and still seal. Um, something I learned about um, eclipse photo paper um, this stuff here a couple days ago was uh, $14.95 on Amazon and free shipping um, the next day I woke up and checked it again it was $54.99 and $39 shipping to make sure it's here by the date which is still over two weeks away so if you're gonna do this uh, don't hesitate when it's time to get supplies get your supplies what i did here um this kit this eclipse smart kit was uh at best buy for 24.99 it comes with the glasses and it comes with this this photo filter you see here to hold in front of your camera or hold in front of a uh, cell phone so what i did was i took and uh, glued that to the the piece that i made to slip over my slip over my telephoto lens here so when it's extended this piece will actually slide on and off real nice and easy but still keep the light out what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go ahead and trim this down now and I'm gonna take and reinforce this with some tape around here to make sure I don't have any light leaks or anything um, so this kit here is $24.99, come with the glasses, came with this filter, um, which is going to work out good. Now, from what I'd read about filters for, the, for a filter to film this event, um, the only person that has one in stock right now is uh, B&H Photo, I believe it is, B&H Camera online and it's $140 that screws into here problem with the part one that screws on when you're doing the eclipse is you're trying to keep this in the exact same place um, and then you're trying to screw something on screw something off you're liable to move your move your lens a little bit and not get the desired effect you want this right here should be able to slide off and on relatively smooth and easy and hopefully won't move much the um the things that I lined it with on the inside is a self-adhesive type um, little piece of foam. And after I line the inside of it all nice and around right there, it fits my 58 millimeter uh, telephoto lens. I mean, like a glove, slides on and off real nice. Hopefully this is going to give me the desired effect I want. And uh, after, after it passes, uh, I'll be sure to post some videos. This will be my first time trying to photograph uh, the Eclipse, and I'm hoping... So, I, I just wanted to show you the fitment of this. Get a little bit better light on it, too. This is the inside after I uh, lined it with the uh, foam. And this is my 58 millimeter telephoto lens. Now, I should be able to just slide it on real nice and gently and, and take it back off. It is a little snug at this moment, but I haven't worked it on and off yet much so hopefully by the time i get to game day here it's going to be you know where i can just barely glide it on there but i'm 
hoping the result's going to come out fantastic. So, there it is. I've got uh, $10 in this. This was a, a filter that came with a $25 kit that also came with the glasses and a book to explain the eclipse and the times and everything else. So, I hope this has been helpful to you guys. If it has, do me a favor, like, share, subscribe. And if you get some videos with your, uh, some videos or some footage with your uh, homemade filter, please do me a favor and uh, tag it, uh, upload the video, upload the photos, and tag it in the comments, and I'll be sure to check it out and share it with everybody else. So, this has been He Who Angers You. I hope you guys capture the photos you want.